find it and getting response can be really powerful. So, um, I'll, I can actually steer if, I can, if that's good. This is, our, this is our nonprofit. We're a 501c3. We're called the PPF and we're based all over the place. And, oh, hon, can we flip this around so that I can type? So I'm going I'm to do a quick live demo of how this works. <clears throat> so we developed this website coming soon. And I'm very pleased to say that it features um, open source code contributions from Derek and Eric here in the Chicago scene with DataMade um, and a lot of other folks from around uh, the Chicago scene like Juan have helped with uh, advice and more. Um, and this is a question and answer platform with elected officials. We've standardized data for 142,000 elected officials nationwide at the federal, state, county, and municipal levels of government. And we believe, to our knowledge, we're the first open source public benefit project to do this. So we're really excited to get out into the wild. And I want to shout out the Knight Foundation's Tech for Engagement program uh, with a generous grant that helped us get this far. So I'm going to, I'm going to put this down for a second so I can type into the, I can type in. Um, from, this, uh, from our homepage, entering any zip code, for example, the Chicago zip code where we are now, will let you, We'll bring you to a list of questions that were submitted to elected officials by people near you. You can browse questions you want to support and sign on. And importantly, you can flip over and see all of your, here you go, you can see all of your elected officials for the first time on an open source website, your federal, your state, and your municipal elected officials. You can dive in and find who represents you and see the top questions to this elected official by people near you and you can see what you support what you want to sign on to. <clears throat> and if you sign on to a question, we'll, if it reaches the threshold, we'll deliver it over email and social media and press for an open public response to continue an online public dialogue. And we are encouraging elected officials to sign up with our, not, with our nonprofit <coughs> open data app in order to uh, answer questions publicly on Ask Them. And there's a little bit more I wanted to point out, which is that from using some of the code, uh, the open source code for um, scraping city council agendas that Derek and others have pioneered, we we're able to bring in uh, agendas for city council meetings. So we hope that this is a tool that you'll use to say, there's a city council meeting coming up, here are the top questions that are uh, being asked by constituents in my district, or here are the issues that are trending in my community. So that way we're hoping that this becomes an organizing platform for the self-empowerment of communities at the local level. And I'll just go into the asking a question process. <clears throat> you can enter a street address for where we are. Chicago. And then entering your zip code pops up all of your elected officials. You can go, you can see that um, actually not all the city council uh, officials will show up in uh, when we launch soon, but you can see your your US senators, your governor, and your representative. You can select who you want to ask a question to. I'm gonna go back up to Mayor Emanuel. There we go. And then advance and ask him your question. And then press for an answer in an open public forum. So we hope that this is a, a useful online tool for public dialogue and pressing for public accountability and engagement. So I'll be excited to show you more about uh, some of the other features of the site soon. I'm going to wrap it up here right now, but I'm around all night and happy to chat. There are three ways that you can help us. The first is that we have a, a landing page up at askthem.io. So please spread it far and wide, circulate it. We're building to a public launch date. Simply enter your email address there and you'll, be, you'll join our, uh, our email list, which of course we manage responsibly. Um, you can also see that there's a space for elected officials to sign up. So that's my second ask of you, is that if you can go to your elected officials at the city council level, at the county level, or at the state and federal level and say, sign up with Ask Them and answer about two or three questions per month from your constituents in an open public forum, that will really help us with this, with this open source public benefit project. Um, and I can forward some materials that can help you explain to them what the virtues are of this sort of online uh, dialogue and engagement. And uh, the last way you can help us is that if you're a developer or you're a programmer, there's always lots of improvements that we could use. We're an open source project. You can help us build the ability to, to, to sort of filter up questions uh, for public meetings to the city council or to the state legislature. And you can always help us improve the scraping of uh, Chicago city data. Um, thanks very much, Dan. Appreciate the opportunity to talk. Thanks.